Hey guys, it's Mars here, and I wanted to talk about something that may be a little bit controversial on YouTube, uh, but fact is, it's got to be talked about. I, I don't think I can get around this any longer. I felt it was the good time now with a Call of Duty video uh, out of everything. When I started this thing, uh, the YouTube thing, I wanted to make videos. That's all I wanted. I didn't want to make Call of Duty videos, I didn't want to make Minecraft videos, I just wanted to make videos, have fun. And, uh, and the goal here is to, to make a community something that resembles a family where we can all respect each other, we have different tastes, different things we like uh, in games, music, different religious beliefs, just general life beliefs, morals, uh, stuff like that. And we could kind of all accept each other and accept ourselves in this community, which at that point is pretty much like a big family. So that's what I wanted. And I'm not thriving to hit 100,000 subscribers. I'm not thriving to hit 10,000 or 1,000. I'm just thriving on getting this community built. And that's what I like doing. And that's what I wanted to do. Uh, it's both an exercise for me as a person to do this um, and kind of as a YouTuber, because a lot of the time, uh, people disagree on stuff and, and have different views. I want to know and I want you guys to know that everything is kind of accepted here and um, and we can talk to each other and, and get through different things. Anyways, I'm getting a little sidetracked here. What I wanted to talk about is YouTube defines you as what kind of gamer you are. If you start posting Call of Duty, then you're, you know, you're a Call of Duty gamer. That's what you post. That's what your channel is. So people don't necessarily see you as anything else. If you start doing Minecraft, same thing. People will see you as Minecraft, um, as, as kind of someone who, who makes those kinds of videos. I don't want to be defined as, as one or the other or anything else, really. I don't want to be defined, period. Um, if, if you would have to define me, it would be that I'm willing to try new things. I'm willing to kind of extend... Um, out of reach to something new and different. I don't want to be known as someone who does one thing. I want to be known as someone who will try new things and um, and put some time into it to really make great content because that, cause that's what I, I try to do overall. No matter what I do, I try to make the, the best content I, I am capable of producing. So what does that mean? That means that I'm not saying Call of Duty is back there's a video you're gonna watch it um, I, I really did get tired of it and that that happens I mean it, it happens with every game but I also was kind of tired of having of having this feeling where I had to make Call of Duty videos all the time and at a certain point uh, I, it did feel like that for Minecraft as well I want to do what makes me happy but I also want to do what makes you guys happy so if I can have a variety that's what I'm gonna go with so I don't, I, I don't want to be defined as this guy who does things for the views because that's not who I am. I do things for the community to grow that. And I think that's really important with me um, and what kind of makes me stand out as other YouTubers. I, I don't think a lot of people thrive for that. And I think it's something that, that is quite important to me and that I hold close to my heart. And hopefully you guys do as well. I watch a variety of people on YouTube whether it's Call of Duty Zombies or multiplayer gameplay. It can be some MMOs that I've watched a little bit of. I've watched some Minecraft, plenty of Minecraft. Um, cause my, be, because of, of the kind of freedom in Minecraft, I guess it's really easy to kind of get into that. And, and the things people do with Minecraft is is just really amazing. There, there is a freedom and, and there is something really special about that game. But anyways, what I want to say is... I'm not going to st stick to one thing. I'm going to do everything I want uh, because people tend to forget it is my channel. And um, and people tend to forget that with YouTubers. It's their channel. They have creative control over what they do, uh, what they produce, and, and what they say. Of course, there are certain limitations, and we know that as, as people to not push those limitations. Yes, that's, that's completely our responsibility as uh, content producers. But... The fact is, it, we are in control of, of the content we produce. Now that I have been partnered, that content is still not going to change. I'm still not going to do things for the views. I'm going to do things because I like them first. If it happens to pay off uh, in a sense that I, I get views out of it, then sure. Um, you know, If I'm enjoying Call of Duty, then I will repost some Call of Duty. If I get tired of it, I will take a break because I don't think anyone wants to watch content that I don't want to make. 
it, it, it's not the best content to watch because it's lazy, there's not much effort put into it, and um, so on and so forth. So I, I think what I'm trying to say is I'm going to try to be the guy on YouTube who does a little bit of everything, and I hope you guys appreciate it and uh, enjoy me for that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching the videos, guys. Please remember to leave a like and comment. Uh, that's important. If you don't like the video, dislike and comment the shit out of it. I completely encourage you. And um, if you're not already subscribed, just hit that button. It doesn't hurt anyone. It helps me out. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.